Hi, it's Adrian. How are you doing today? Um, so I'm trying on some new products and some old products today. As far as my base, I had the Max Studio Radiance and then the Maybelline uh, Perfector 4-in-1 shade 00. So that's what I have on as far as my base. I do have the Pretty Fresh Concealer on as well. That one's from ColourPop. And let's see. As far as uh, on the cheeks, I have the Flower Heat Wave uh, bronzer on, and then the Found uh, Baked Illuminating Blush. This one's in rose gold, so uh, that's what I have on the cheeks there, and a little bit of the Seismic from ColourPop as far as a highlighter. Um, I also have a little bit of the Beauty Pie on the cheek as a topper, so that's what I have on there. And uh, let's see, as far as going to the lipstick next, um, I have the Superstay Ink Crayon by Maybelline on in this color. This is 140. Yeah, 140. And then the Red Blonde Gloss as well. Um, on top of that, let me go ahead and put a little bit more gloss on. So that's a rough on the gloss. It's really pretty. And then as far as the eyeshadow, the AOA Perfect Primer on there. Um, with the AOA, you can get that at the Miss A website. And uh, that's where you'll find this brand. Everything uh, usually runs for about a dollar. And then as far as what do I have on my eyes, um, I have the Wink Stamp by Kaja, and that's to go ahead and do, uh, yeah, the little bit of a wing that I have on the end there. Um, I definitely have on the Cream Gel ColourPop um, Eyeliner in black, and I actually thought black would be too dark because with most taupes, uh, they're going to lean a little bit moth or, you know, uh, maybe a little bit beige. But I got the Essence Taupe It Up, which is this cute little palette. I got it on Ulta online. Uh, they run about $3.99. Except for this one, um, you'd think that it would run a little bit beige or moth, but no, it runs blue. Um, so, as far as the way the look turned out, it kind of, let's see, kind of just led me into going ahead and doing an old school smoky eye with it. And um, what I did end up doing uh, was uh, this color under the brow. And then I went ahead and did this one on the inner corner, going all the way up to the brow. And I did this on the lid. And then, um, actually, I didn't even use this one. I thought I was going to end up using that one. But since I used the black to go ahead and do a wing, um, those were the only two colors. No, those were the only three colors. And then um, I tried all the colors, and uh, they all lean blue. And that's very strange for a taupe, uh, palette, but that's the way this one worked. And so I added a wing and some liner and came up with an old school, definitely old school look, old school smoky eye look. And um, as far as my brows, let's see, I used the Essence, the Make Me Brow in the light brown. And then I went ahead and used the Sky High Mascara. Uh, mixed with the Essence uh, Lash Princess and Curl and Volume. So these are the two that I mixed as far as the eyelashes go. And um, yeah, uh, definitely not what I was expecting with this palette. But um, yeah, it worked. Uh, definitely a very great, cool tone look. And um, I think that's it. So uh, the as far as this palette goes, the pigments, the pigments definitely there. It definitely blends together. Um, again, just know that it does lean more blue 
Um, and uh, other than that, yeah, at three ninety nine, it's a bargain and adds a lot of pigment. So um, I think that's it. And uh, thank you and have a great day. Okay.